Okay, so what I've been doing here, I've been having a, a really, really hard time, like, trying to figure out how to get your different waypoints, you know, set up into your GPS. And there's so many videos on YouTube, and, you know, a lot of guys, you know, are really, really good at it, really quick at it. Some guys, you know, whatever. Uh, well, they're a lot better than me, because at least they're getting these, these numbers in it, and they can get the airplane to fly to these waypoints. But... Anyway, after, you know, I've been, I've been fooling around with this for, for two weeks and, you know, trying, you know, different things with a, my, the Boeing 737, you know, and the Cessna, this is the stock 172 SP. And I came across a video that, that had helped me quite a bit, but it still wasn't going to the waypoints. Ex example, this Habs, okay, I'm, I'm right now flying uh, uh, Quebec, I'm going into Montreal uh cyul is the final destination point i've already passed a few waypoints but i figured i'd make this video uh, for those that are having a hard time getting your airplane to go to the waypoints because what would happen it would show you know what i was doing before it would show this in the gps and it would have this you know cumulative mark mark here and it's supposed to count down right it's supposed to you know give, giving you how long it's going to take to get there or the nautical miles whatever the case is and these numbers would go to, you know, 24.2, 24.1. And sometimes they'd even go down to like 6.3, 6.2, 6.1. Next thing you know, they start climbing again, 6.2, 6.3, 6, so, uh, 6.4. So I'm going away from the from the waypoint. It's underneath me somewhere or I'm at an angle where now I'm, it's just not following it. And I, I couldn't get that to work. So anyway, inside of this area, when I was fooling around with these numbers, I happened to hit my my menu uh i don't know they just i was just clicking buttons and i came up to this this screen and i think the down here on this outside of this wheel i think this just will change yeah i think yeah the default uh was save flight plan and i just said huh what's this leg stuff activate leg okay so i did this and i hit the enter button and then what had happened all this still showed what it showed and i went down into i hit my flight plan and in the GPS, all of a sudden, everything came alive. The airplane started, you know, going in a completely different direction. And all these way different waypoints that I had in here, now it was showing the ETA, you know, and, the, and it's counting down in minutes and stuff. And, and I'm watching this and saying, okay, well, I don't know why I haven't seen that before about activating that or, or getting it to work in the GPS. And I was, I was fooling around with the... Uh, autopilot uh, or trying to get this thing to to follow these numbers and, and what I did is I ended up uh, going down to your navigation and hitting it a couple times until you get this little GPS this comes up and says GPS right here okay and one other thing you have to make sure you're 530 hitting this button will change it from from VLOG to GPS. So once that is activated, the airplane just starts going where it's supposed to be. And it's it was like I give myself a big pat on the back for just, you know, hitting these numbers because, like I say, I've been fooling around with this for weeks. And uh, using SimBrief to make my initial plans, and it comes up with these various waypoints. And there's a map underneath here where you can go and you can check the waypoints. And some of them are invalid. And I find that a lot uh but there's invalid waypoints so i went into sky vector and i started looking at some of these you know different waypoints and things that were on the the actual flight route and when you sort of click on them it kind of gives you you know tells you what the waypoint is or what it's named or whatever the case is and and i started putting that into the flight log and then uh once i generated the report and i came here i started entering all the numbers in and Bingo, nothing's working, just like normal. Until I came up to this menu and everything, like I said, I had a couple more waypoints here, and I, I, I hit that menu, and as soon as I went to enter right down here to uh, enter that, and I went back to my flight plan, everything changed. So hopefully somebody will have some good luck with that, and hopefully I sort of kind of made sense. Uh, rock on, keep flying.